Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the Electric Israeli. And today's video is going to be about what, in my opinion, and based on what I read lately, <coughs> the uh, cars or car manufacturers who are really going to burst and really, really be a game changers in the future. And these cars and car manufacturers that I'm going to talk about are for the uh, masses, for the ones in the middle. And you'll be surprised which car or cars I'm going to leave off the list. So I'm going to start, actually, believe it or not, number four, I will call it, um, with a VW Volkswagen, uh, which is going to, to, go, to go into producing 30... 30 new EVs by 2025. In other words, the entire lineup of Volkswagen, which is the biggest car manufacturer in the world, is going to be turned over into electric. Now, why do I put it number four and not number one? Is because, after all, we're talking about Volkswagen and they are doing it because they got caught with the... Um, with the uh, um, uh, diesel scandal, which was hor horrific. So, uh, do I trust them? Of course I don't. But they're introducing, here's some pictures, they're introducing uh, the, uh, this minibus. I remember that minibus when I grew up as a kid. Everybody in my town used to have, everybody used to drive that car, that, that Volkswagen minibus. And uh, it even was it was in back in Back to the Future movie in the first one, if you remember one of the first scenes. Um, so uh, that and of course the Beetle and other sedans. So their plan is to have 30, 30 uh, EVs coming by twenty fifteen. So that is a game changer in the economy in the economy segment. In other words. Oh, sorry about the sun. In the economy segment, and that would be amazing. Uh, the number, the next one I'm going to talk about is uh, a Hyundai. Uh, Hyundai has obviously now the uh, the uh, Ionic, uh, the, the pure electric, and the and the and the plug-in hybrid and the and the uh, hybrid. So that's not the car I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is the SUV, and as you know. America loves SUVs, and they are talking about coming up with a 300 plus miles SUV, which leads me right into Ford. And Ford, believe it or not, Ford, actually, if you look at the last year, year before um, uh, car sales, you'll see that um, you'll see that uh, there um, they used to like if you. All the cars that they sell, sold together every month, like the Fusion, the the C Max, the 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 Focus, even though the Focus didn't sell that much, but they used to be like in the two thousand per month. Now they're coming down and whatever. But 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 but, they are going into the uh, SUV or the or the mini SUV, like uh, like like the Escape like car, uh, talking about three hundred miles or so, and that is that it can be a, a game changer. And the number one game changer, in my opinion, and that's coming this year, it's already rolled out, is the 150 miles Nissan Leaf, but more importantly, the 200 miles Nissan Leaf coming into uh, the end of this year. And say whatever you want about how the Nissan Leaf looks like, I'm driving one right now, they're still the manufacturers who sold the most. They make them uh, in the United States, in Europe, in Japan, they sell tens and th tens of thousands of them, and uh, and I think the uh, the current Nissan Leaf, the one 150 miles and the 200 plus miles, this will be the uh, really really the game changer. So these four, and I, and it's here's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the car. It's around 30,000 or so to be as as a game changer. Now add to that incentive, state and local, and all that. A state, I mean, in federal and all that, then you will, then you're talking about real economy car. So who did I leave off? I left off Tesla Model 3, believe it or not, with all their reservations, and it's amazing, I'm one of them, 
and all and all the hoopla Tesla Model 3 is a $45 to $60,000 car. Now, I know there's a $35,000 car and people will buy it, but if you put anything into it, anything, any, anything, really, anything that they offer, uh, you're talking about $45 to $60,000 miles, to $60,000. So, what I'm saying, I will not put Tesla Model 3 in the mainstream uh, econ economy, uh, middle class people, uh, sector, group, those who buy most of the cars. Okay? So uh, I take it out. And Chevy Bolt, believe it or not, I took off Chevy Bolt as well because I see the sales and I see the productions and I don't know, I, 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 I still don't have that faith that uh, they will uh, continue to really be serious about it and go to the SUV market. Now, if they go to the SUV market and if uh, uh, the model, the, um, the uh, uh, Chevy Bolt will be in the lower uh, range. I mean, the basic Chevy Bolt costs 37 something. All right, talking of putting two things in it, you go, you're getting to 42,000. So, I, I, I still don't have that faith in GM, even though I drive a Volt and I absolutely love it. But I'm talking about in global, so I, I'm, I'm, I'm not including uh, Chevy and I'm not including Tesla Model 3 because I think most of the Tesla Model 3s that will be sold here in America and around the world with the 45 to 60,000 which limits the... Now, if the 35,000 Model 3 will be produced in mass and bought by people and will have some, something more than just a battery in a steering wheel, then that could be included. But I think uh, Volkswagen and I think uh, 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 Hyundai slash Kia and, um, and Ford and Nissan can be game changer in the next five to seven years. What do you think? Am I right? Am I wrong? Is there anybody else? Is it a dark horse that we don't see? What do you think? And remember, selling mass produced car has to be in a price range of 25 35 that's it that's it most of the people in that range that can buy that can buy those cars now of course i was talk about i talk about used car and how they uh, as they come into the market more people get them but that's another story okay that's it the electric is rally here please subscribe to my channel and help me change the world one electric car at a time